Hi there, welcome back. In this lesson I'm going to be showing you how to create a lovely relief map, um, shaded relief map, um, based on a raster image from Natural Earth. So first thing we need to do is go off to Natural Earth and download the raster image. So click on the raster data and they've got quite a few options but the one I'm going to show you today is the shaded relief one. So click on that and you want to download the large size one. Um, so go ahead and do that and it shouldn't take too long, it's only 40 meg or so. Um, once you have downloaded it, I'm just going to get rid of the layer I've got here. So just get rid of that and then load in the natural earth one. Just drag it into your window. There we go. So you can see it's actually quite different from the version that you just saw. Um, basically, I've changed a few settings um, in the layer to make it look like how I want to. So let's just run through what those changes are. Okay. So I'm just going to load in the style so you can see what the changes are. Okay, so you can see in the background that's changed the view of the um, relief file very drastically. So the main things I've changed are the min and maximum zero and basically the white to black. Um, the closer those numbers are together, the higher the um, contrast. So I've spread it out to make it nice and low contrast. So it, it's got a nice hint of the um, relief, but it doesn't dominate the uh, map. If it's too dark, then obviously having labels and borders and tints and stuff make it very hard to read. So I prefer this um, lighter, more subtle version. Um, so the other things I changed were, I just changed the brightness of the image and just increased the contrast ever so slightly. And that was pretty much all I changed. So as you can see, it adds a lovely texture to your map. And the other thing I actually want to do is just change the blending node mode to multiply. And that'll just darken. So basically what it does is it basically applies those um, the colors and the tints on your um, raster file through to the colors underneath. Um, so let's turn that off, you can see the colors underneath. So I've got these all very light buff color and they're sort of greeny gray. So by changing the layer mode to multiply, it allows the um, those colors to show through. So I hope you found this interesting and pl play with all the different um, settings on your um, natural on your natural relief on your natural earth relief file. You can change the colors of it too. If you want to colorize it for some reason, you can change that and it'll basically apply the colors to your tint layer. So there's loads of different things you can do with this. So have a play. Let's say if I change the contrast. Let's just turn that colorize off because it looks horrible. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, there's many, many options you can play with. So see what you come up with. And when you're happy with a style that you like, then you can just save it and then um, you've got it available for later use. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this one.